hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a get ready with me video my little sister is celebrating her communion and i'm going to be bringing you guys along as i get ready i don't normally go out to events like this i actually don't really go out often i'm a very big homebody and i spend a lot of time at home or working or at my job so i'm really excited to get ready and i thought it would be a lot of fun to bring you guys along with me I have my outfit picked out and I'm going to be doing my hair and makeup more than I usually would. So I thought that this would be a great opportunity to do a video of like a get ready with me. So I hope that you guys enjoy watching this type of video. If you like it, let me know and I can try to make more like this for events that I go to in the future. So now we could just get into the video and I'm just going to be starting off at the beginning of my day where I started getting ready. Hi guys, so I wanted to bring you along for the day of getting ready with me. I bought this beautiful dress and I'm so excited to wear it even though I am in New York and it is still pretty cold here. It's only going to reach about 55 today so I do think I'm going to be cold but that's okay. Um, I planned this dress about two months ago and I bought it for this occasion so I'm extremely excited to wear it. I straightened my hair yesterday because I do want to curl my hair today. I don't curl my hair often and I think that it would look really pretty so that is going to be part of getting ready. I also am going to put on a little bit more makeup than I usually wear just because I want to put myself together and look pretty and I'm really excited to take pictures and just get ready for the day and celebrate with my family. So obviously the first step of getting ready, I did straighten my hair yesterday and I didn't want it to be like a fresh straighten just because my hair does not hold curls when I straighten it and then curl it. So that's why I straightened it yesterday and I let it get a little bit messy just so that it will hold the curls when I go to curl my hair. But I think that the first step of getting ready is going to be doing my makeup. I want to get that done before I do my hair because I'm going to have to pull my hair back and if I have it curled and then pull it back, I just don't want to ruin it. I'm also going to do my hair later on in the day as we get closer to the time that we have to leave to go to the church. Before I get started on my makeup, I am going to be showing you guys the dress that I picked out. And we're also going to pick out my shoes because I'm not exactly sure what shoes to wear yet. This is the jewelry that I usually wear every day. Just my nameplate necklace and a little circle necklace. But I do think that I am going to put on a cross necklace just because I'm going to the church and it is a religious event. I'm also going to be wearing different earrings because I just have little studs and little hoops in now. But I will be wearing bigger hoops and... I'm really excited to just get ready and feel pretty for the day. So I wanted to quickly show you the dress. It's obviously going to look different on, but you can get an idea of what it looks like now. I bought this from Hollister about two months ago, I want to say. I love the way that it fits me, and I just love the little detailing that it has. It has cute little ruffles on the sleeves, and this is what it looks like on top. So this is the dress that I will be wearing. Now we're going to go ahead and pick out my shoes. I have a few pairs of high heels under here. I don't know if I want to wear any of these, though. I'm thinking about wearing these just because they're the most simple. I also have these, which I know are comfortable because I've worn them multiple times. And then I have a pair of blue heels back here, but I don't think that blue has any um, business for my outfit today. And then those are just a little too fancy, so we're going to see, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up going with these. They're not too high, but they're simple, and I think that they would look pretty with the white dress. I'm putting them on here because I've actually never worn these before, so they are brand new. Otherwise, I obviously wouldn't be putting them on my brand new white dress. But I think that these are the shoes I'm going to end up going with. And now let's go pick out my jewelry. So I do have this little jewelry box, and it has all of my jewelry. It is a little bit tangled up. Um, from my communion and from when I was a baby. This is my little baby bracelet that I've always had. This is a necklace that my grandma bought me when I was a baby, and I wore it for years probably like eight years and I would always chew on it and that's why there's a missing diamond right there so that's why I stopped wearing it it's a really special necklace to me and I just didn't want anything to be missing from it this was given to me for my communion very beautiful necklace this I might wear I am thinking about wearing this bracelet I don't normally wear bracelets but I thought just for the occasion it would be nice I might wear this necklace I also was given this necklace for my communion um, but I don't think I'll wear that one. And then I have this one. So I think that I'm going to be wearing this necklace and this bracelet. Okay, guys. So now that I have my outfit and my shoes and my jewelry picked out, I'm going to go ahead and get started on my makeup. I'm going to bring you guys along as I do my makeup. And I'll probably just do a sped up version of me doing it.
right guys so i am back i started my makeup um i did a little bit of eye makeup and i put on some foundation and um concealer i actually did like a light bb cream because i don't really like wearing heavy foundation but this is what it looks like so far i also did my eyebrows and i'm just saying i always go for a pink eyeshadow look i'm not sure why i just always do um i'm wearing like pinkish heels they're kind of tannish pinkish and then a white dress so i thought pink would look beautiful i am going to do mascara i just haven't decided yet if i want to do eyeliner or not and i still have a few hours to get ready so i am going to do that later i want to let my makeup set a little bit before i lean my hand on my face to do my mascara and possibly eyeliner i'm not sure yet um, I have a kind of a weird eye shape, so I don't love the way I look with eyeliner. So I'm not exactly sure yet if I'm going to do it or not. But that is pretty much it for my makeup other than my mascara and possibly eyeliner for now. Next thing I will be moving on to is going to be my hair. And I will bring you guys along with me for the process of that. I have to say I've only curled my hair a handful of times in my life. So I'm not exactly sure if it's going to work out. I don't know how it's going to look, but you guys will come along with me for the process. <laughs> So I just finished my hair. I'm very happy with how it turned out. I don't curl my hair often at all. So I am not the best at curling it, but I did different curls in different directions and I kind of just brushed it out a little bit. And there's a lot of hairspray in my hair. So that's probably why you see it all moving together. <laughs> But this is what we are working with for the day. Now it's time for me to finish up my makeup and get my dress on and get ready to go out. Okay, so my hair and makeup are both complete. I put mascara on, but I decided not to do eyeliner. I just wanted to go for this type of look. So here is my hair and my makeup all complete. And now I'm going to get dressed and put my jewelry on. Okay, you guys, I'm completely ready and I'm extremely excited to show you my outfit and everything. So to start off, this is what my hair looks like, all completed. And then I put on these earrings, this bracelet I'm wearing. I also have on this necklace that's a cross. And now onto my outfit. So here is my outfit that I am wearing. I showed you guys it before, but this is it on. I still have to put my shoes on. I do not have any on right now. But this is pretty much the completed look of what I'm going to look like. Okay guys, so I just wanted to quickly show you the completed look before I headed out. I have my jewelry on, my necklace is on, and my bracelet. My makeup's all done and my hair is curled. And I'm gonna quickly show you the dress and how it looks on me. Here is the dress on me. It's more of like a romper, but it looks like a dress. Here's what it looks like. And then I have this little pink bag on and it actually matches the shoes that i am wearing out today so that's the completed look for the get ready with me i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you have any video suggestions for videos you'd like to see in the future please let me know and please like comment and subscribe on this video and i'll see you in the next one bye guys